Here we are discussing about Louis Pasteur Jones experiment. When Louis Pasteur became director of scientific studies at college in Paris, Pasteur was thinking about yeast, germs and decay. One question was there in his mind for which he was thinking of answer. That question is whether germs will generate from other germs or they will just multiply by themselves. People like Pasteur believed that germs come from air and infect whatever comes on the way. But others believed they just come spontaneously and not from germs. Therefore, Pasher proved his theory of origin of germs by a simple and clever experiment. He put some soup in some bottles and boiled it to kill existing germs and heated the neck of a bottle till it became long and narrow with a big bend in the middle. The soup remained there for a long time and it didn't spoil in such a bottle with a long neck and bend which was getting spoiled when it kept in a bowl. Pasha said this is because germs will not come from parent germs in soup and there is no parent germs. After that, Pasha poured the soup in the middle bent of the bottle. This soup got spoiled. So Pasha said, the soup in the bend of bottle acted like a dust trap and dust carries germs. So germs travel till soup and get spoiled. Here's another experiment to prove a difference between pure air and stale air. Hundreds of experiments are made by Pasha to prove that how germs may be carried by dust in the air. One of the experiments are very useful to show the difference between pure air and stale air. Pasher filled bottles with a soup. He took some bottles to the hotel bedroom where air was hardly ever changed. Broke their necks off so the air could enter freely. And after a few minutes later Seal them up again. Later, he took some bottles to the field. Broke their necks off so where air could enter the bottle freely. And after a few minutes later, sealed them up. Then, he took some bottles to the top of mountain where a sufficient air was present. He did the same with them. Broke their necks off so the air could enter freely. And after a few minutes later, sealed them up again. What was the result? When they were examined, first one, the bottle opened in the hotel bedroom, were full of a soup which had gone completely moldy, covered with a fungal growth. Second one, the bottle opened in the field, were moldy but not quite so bad. Third one, those opened on the mountain had no germs in them at all. Like this way, he proved difference between pure air and stale air.